Today is Sunday. Today is typically when I do my cleaning. I do it on the Sunday, just for the beginning of the week. And I guess this is day one in a week in the DCP. <laughs> my next tip don't get these they're cheaper but you use a lot more of them in general in trying to get it clean because they're so bad so just get the ones by Swiffer and it'll pay off in the long run just splurge you get the better one I've been thinking my room has been looking a bit bare in terms of decorations, in terms of like art. But I was just very hesitant to put stuff on my wall in general. But I have prints from the resorts I've stayed at so far, the Contemporary and the Polynesian, the 50th versions. So I'm thinking I'm gonna hang it up here. Well, I'm not gonna put, gonna, I'm not gonna take out the plastic. I'm thinking I'll just put the command uh, strips straight onto the plastic and just hang it like that. I just don't want to ruin the prints. Currently 2.40, so I'm going to start getting ready for work. It's a six hour shift, nothing too bad. But it is 34 degrees and it's going to be very hot. Obviously I can't film, so I'm setting it to work now. Welcome to day two of the week. It is now Monday and will be my only day off. I decided to pick up a shift at Ohana because I got something big planning and I gotta save up. We'll reveal later in another video. But today I'm going to be hitching up all of the parks. Basically I have four parks in one day, but not really because I'm just going to each park to pick up a new merchandise item that released and thought it, it would be a nice gift for the other mates. Just gotta board the Skyliner and we'll be at Epcot first. I'm also gonna do Guardians. So, crunching out in time because it's all, currently like almost 12 30. Gotta be in the parks before I hit one so I can get the 1 pm booking. So, be there shortly. I made it 
made it to Epcot. It is absolutely horrible. It's like 35 degrees. I dressed up to look nice. Do not feel nice. The main reason I am here is to shop. Almost there, almost there. Here for that. Found it. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, this is the one. I gotta look for the one that's not too scuffed. Tumblr required. I just gotta head to Magic Kingdom. I'll be back here later to do Guardians, but it's not for another like 200 minutes. So I think I'm gonna head to Animal Kingdom next. Here we go, guys. did a big oopsie daisies. I completely forgot that it's the 3rd of July and we are blocked out of Magic Kingdom for today and tomorrow. So I'm not gonna be able to pick up the Magic Kingdom tumbler until maybe later in the week if I wanna go earlier, then go to work. Oh, what the heck? Oh, birds. It is abusingly hot. Tumblr's around $34, it's not too bad, that's with discount. But they're really nice. So I'm like, it's a nice memento here. Hi babe. And I'm fighting for my life. Oh my god, it's like 36 now. The heat is everywhere. My first stop should be in here. Found it. Third one acquired. Again, can't get the Magic Kingdom one, but I got them all wrapped nice so they don't scratch each other when I go on the rides. First, I gotta go find them. It's story time. So I was just waiting in line. Then I was just on my phone, but I didn't get time to pull out my camera because Mel and his friends were chipping down. And so they ran up and gave me a hug. I didn't have, even have time to whip out my phone to film. So very sad, but I got photos. Got photos right here. Bam, 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 bam. Might wrap it up after doing a few more rides. I tried recording that, but the harness like trapped my phone in my pocket, so I couldn't do it, but next we're doing Tower. I think about two weeks ago, I did Tower, but I was like the last person to go in just before the park closed, and it's always been like on my list to try to get the last elevator. Then that was the first time I've done it, but they literally gave me the whole elevator. I have footage. It's just me freaking out because it's genuinely a lot more scarier when you hear nothing but you hear everything at the same time. You are about to discover what lies beyond the fifth dimension, beyond the deepest, darkest corner of the imagination, in the tower of terror. So dark and scary, what the f where they go this straight alone. <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> ah, oh, oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, oh, In the line for guardians i technically wrote this just then but something happened on the ride so they're letting us rewrite it i'll tell you again in a bit once i rewrite it because that was weird quickly going back to the story of what was going on at the guardians ride if you're familiar with the ride the lift hill just before um the spiral around the moon we're starting to get up the lift hill then the projections you would, would have been able to see ahead of you were going. Almost make it all the way up, then it starts rolling backwards. It rolls back, gets to like the um, unload station, and just stays there. But we could still see other vehicles just going in the background. Then after about a minute and a half or two minutes, it just picks up, continues, no audio, gets around the moon, the moon's not even lit up, no projections. Then everybody was just kind of confused. Guess the unload on the unload station. It was just a bunch of maintenance people. Then cast members like, if you want to rewrite, follow me, go through there. Yeah, I got to rewrite it 
again, so I did it twice in a day. And we got a better song that's September, one of my personal favorites. So I'm not complaining. Now it is 4th of July, and I've been looking online, and apparently yesterday, for the third, Magic Kingdom was already at max capacity. So I don't know what to expect. It could just be a normal day. Could just be about the worst day on like working as an attractions cast member, but who's to say? But it's currently um, 2.20. Gonna get ready in about 10 more minutes. I'm gonna go early, but I don't wanna be late, because the past few times, the buses have just been packed and busy, and it's not fun. I did take a photo right here of what it was like trying to get home the other night on the Route E bus. Everybody was packed to the brim. There were people sitting right next to the bus driver at the front, and people are just fighting for space. I'm gonna go get ready. Oh uh, yeah, just quickly, um, I wasn't able to record a lot yesterday towards the end of the day because my phone was overheating because it was so hot. I woke up today and for some reason I was like, damn, I wonder why it's so warm all of a sudden. I don't know what's going on with my aircon system. It's currently 80 degrees when it's set to 70. It's just, I don't, I, I don't know what's going on. It's just annoyingly warm right now. Like I got... Good idea, I'm turn on the fan. I don't know why the Arakan has just decided to just kill itself right now. I got home a while ago and it's not any better. It's worse. How the hell? I am dying right now. Everybody in the apartment is fighting for their life. I already put a request to get it like sorted out, but it's not gonna get sorted out till tomorrow. And it's so hot right now. And it's already bad in and of itself, but the humidity, add that on top of it. It's not going to get any better. I'll go into more details on what 4th of July was like tomorrow, because right now I just need to try to sleep. <laughs> Good luck to me. As you can see, it's a beautiful Wednesday afternoon. I currently picked up a an Ohana ship, and I'm just making my way to the bus. What about timing? Oh my god. So, yesterday, not much else happened other than going to my Ohana shift. It was great to be back at my old location. Got to see a lot of my old co-workers. It was a lot more people because of the summer crowds. There was one really funny interaction. Um, so yeah, I screwed up. I recently finished this not too long ago, and after some careful consideration and reviewing the video, it is in my best interest if I don't share any of this publicly online. I'm going to refrain from talking about any guest interactions I have had, unless they are positive, such as getting this little nifty pop socket from a guest that I helped find their stroller. This last one on my first day, actually, a little neat keychain. See, I could be a cool cast member. I wasn't completely unproductive today. I was also editing a new video. It's not that long, unfortunately. But today, another closing shift. days and it's the end of the week. So last night, my shift, surprisingly, it was a lot harder. The crowds were just a lot bigger than what I was used to. So there's just a lot more people, but they did let me extend. That was the first time they let me extend because somebody wanted to leave early. Even better, I got the park clear, but there's supposed to be a video that dropped today. It's currently Friday. Only just finished it around uh, 30 minutes ago. Uploaded it, scheduled for tomorrow. I have to go into work though in about start getting ready now. Last time I, I cut it close, I was rushing. And we'll see if I actually end up going to Magic Kingdom tomorrow. Because I still need to get a tumbler for myself. I'm gonna get ready. Good 
Good morning, friends. It is now the last day in the week. And surprisingly, I woke up very early. I woke up at 8 when I went to bed at 3 a.m. So, took advantage of that. Now, heading to Magic Kingdom early to go pick up the final tumbler of the set. I'm not planning to spend the rest of my day there before work. I might head to one of the resorts just to relax. Because I don't really feel like riding any attractions and as you can tell, not the best weather. Well, I did go to Mag Magic Kingdom, of course, and got a few things. First off, been eyeing this tote bag forever. It's on sale. On top of the cast discount, so it's even better. Bam. Finally got it. And it's nice because my attractions are represented on it. The reason I didn't I didn't film much else after work yesterday because I was just absolutely just exhausted. The one mentality guests have at the moment, especially around 4th of July, instead of going on the actual date, they've been going either before or after just to avoid the crowd. Parks have just been swamped, especially at Magic Kingdom. If you ever come to any Disney park or any theme park by that matter, enter the line with your whole party. Another thing, most attractions have two touch points. You stand at the entrance, then at the merge point where standby and lightning lane meet. So keep your tickets out and have your phones ready to scan. And we'll see how my shift goes. I'll check in later. Today was much worse. Alright, one more story time before I end the video. First though, before all of that, I'm gonna cook food because I need to have some form of dinner at least. So today, somehow, was even worse. The past two days have been hard. Yeah, so this was another section I was very proud of. I was trying out something new with the editing. Again, let me know in the comments if you are interested. Just stay tuned. Back to the video. Again, I'm only doing about six hour shifts, but bear in mind, it is attractions. I'm tired, but hopefully you've enjoyed this video. I'm trying to figure out how to make it at least somewhat interesting because one of the biggest draws is going to the parks, but I do not have it in me to go to the parks all the time. And especially with my upcoming schedule, the only day I have off is this Wednesday and I really don't want to go to the parks. <laughs> I'm going to have dinner, I'm going to go to sleep, and this is what my week in the DCP looks like. Well, hopefully stay tuned for any other new videos. Make sure to subscribe, hit that like button. Thanks for joining me.